As promised, we're back at the Green Hills Butterfly Ranch, this time to show you some of the hummingbirds that are here. The butterflies might be captive, but the hummingbirds fly free, and uh, if you're not careful, they can run into you. There are numerous feeders on the property. I think Eric said that they'd seen 14 different species within the last week. And I know that there were several here today. Hopefully you can hear their wing beats on the audio track. They're very vocal little birds. The feeders hung in little pools of sunlight, so the lighting was just perfect. In the garden were several seating areas where you could just observe the birds to make it easier. This one was actually covered in plant life and was very cool, Barb said, but she didn't share was very disconcerting when they all flew off in different directions. You had no idea whether you could be the target. Belize offers so many adventure-packed, adrenaline-filled things to do that sometimes this kind of ecotourism is overlooked, except by few. If you have hummingbirds in your home, wherever you live, then coming and seeing all these brand new species is kind of cool. The butterfly ranch is surrounded by literally an untouched jungle. There is quite a lot of bird and animal life living adjacent to us here. So you could see a lot of different animals and birds if you're quiet and you stay long enough. The hummingbirds were a little overwhelming at times. Eric mentioned the nature trails, but unfortunately we just didn't have time that day. If you sit long enough with the hummingbirds, you can see a couple of fairly rare ones. We were amazed. Wasn't until you actually got back and were able to look at the pictures and the video a little more clearly to see just what was there and who'd come visiting while you'd been watching. That was interesting. Some flew by themselves and some flew in groups. Not sure whether they were families or hatchlings. I don't know enough about hummingbirds to tell. I know that there were a lot of ones here that we'd never seen. And it was a very fun afternoon watching them. And they really do suck back that drink. You can watch their throat right there. That one was pretty rare, apparently. And sizes. Some were very, very small, and others were very large for what I would consider hummingbirds. The property is covered in exotic plant life. That, of course, brings in the birds, the butterflies, the animals. So if you're a birder, it's very worthwhile to drop in and see Eric and the crew. The Green Hills Butterfly Ranch. Much more than just a butterfly ranch. Trust me, come by and enjoy. The Green Hills Butterfly Ranch is located at mile 8 of the Chickaboo Road. Thanks to everyone who watches as we approach 2 million views, to all our subscribers and those of you who share. Follow our adventures as we bump down the dusty roads in Belize.